What's up good people? Welcome to Art Boy TV. This is your girl Courage White with more interesting news. Vibes Cartel and his three co-defendants have been freed from a Jamaican prison where the ailing dancehall star spent years behind bars. In an anonymous decision Wednesday, the court decided against a retrial in the murder of Cliff Lizard Williams, whose body was never found. I know I am innocent and I'm getting out, Vibes Cartel said. The stunning decision from the Jamaican Court of Appeal had the internet and the island in a frenzy on Wednesday. Fans gathered in Tower gathered on Tower Street to see the limousine with the Tansel superstar Vibes Cartel leaving the Tower Street Adult Correctional Facility. Millions of fans from all over the world, including Jamaica, the United the United Kingdom, Africa, and the United States, watched closely as the court read the final decision. We conclude that the interest of justice does not require a new trial to be ordered. Cattell was seen leaving Tower Street Adult Correctional Facility wearing all white and an orange bandana, bandana around his head and face. Along his fiancée and Tom Thompson, Tommy Thompson of Bright Little Funeral Home, Dancehall Superstar Vibes Cattell leaves the Tower Street Adult Correctional Facility on Wednesday after being set free by the Court of Appeal and he was seen alongside his fiancée Sidem Ostuk and Tommy Thompson of Bright Light Funeral Home. Hundreds lined up outside the Tower Street Correctional Facility chanting Free Wild Boss, Free Wild Boss, according to the Jamaican, uh, according to the Jamaican cleaner. As he walked out, Cartel also reportedly told children to stay out of trouble. In an anonymous decision on Wednesday, the court decided against a retrial in the murder of Cliff Lizard Williams, whose body was never found. The court said on Wednesday that there was sufficient evidence to suggest that Cartel would not be able to complete a potentially longer sentence if there were to be a retrial. The court cited the psychological and financial effects that it would have on the appellant, referring, referring to Cartel's health. The court said on Wednesday that there was sufficient evidence to suggest that Cartel would not be able to complete a potentially longer sentence if there were to be a trial, a retrial. The court cited the psychological and financial effects that it would have on the appellant referring to Cartel's health. The dancehall star has reportedly been battling Graves' disease since 2011. Now the Jamaican sensational singer is walking on the streets of his island freely again. The renowned dancehall artist formerly known as Adija Palmer posted on Instagram hours after his release holding a champagne bottle. I'm out, me and my wife, Vibes Cartel said on the video. The video on Instagram has gathered nearly half a million likes and has sparked debate over his fiancée who was in the car next to him. Sidem Ostuk, Cartel's fiancée, is seen in the video kissing the superstar as he praises her. Fox 5's Lisa Eva spoke to Ostuk in 2022 when the couple confirmed they got engaged that summer during an unauthorized prison visit. Sidem was never publicly outspoken before then. Did he actually propose to you? Have a song to propose to you? Can you share some of that with us? Eva asked her. Ostak replied, How it happened was, we were just calling each other hubby and wifey and he was like, we are heading towards marriage. So you calling me hubby or me calling you wifey is not serious enough. You are my fiancé, we are going to get married. Ostak studied psychology and was employed to London as a social worker helping vulnerable adults and children. She left it all behind to move closer to love, to the love of her life. She, wa she was also the muse for Cartel's EP titled True Le Religion. Ostak says, he is smart. I love his heart. He has an amazing heart. It's just so giving. So loving, I love to call him my angel. He he is an angel in my life. I can't deny how happy he makes me feel. Now that's the news we had for you today from Artboy TV. It was me, your girl, Courage Whites.